everyone welcome back to my channel planning for reality and welcome to the challenge video for this week thank you so 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 much to everyone that has been so kind to me watching my videos supporting me commenting saying so such kind words encouraging me i really appreciate it so 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 much um i really need to hear those things so thank you um, so this is my challenge video for the week and um, I'm really excited to do this one because I'm excited to start one of the challenges. So before we get into that one, um, if you remember I was doing the Every Cent Counts challenge from silver. So I've been collecting my silvers and I do apologize for the background noise. The kids um, are still away. And I do apologize for the shadow. It is evening here. So for silver this week, we have 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, a dollar and 10. So we can color two icons. Um, yeah, but this is the time that I have right now. So I am going to make a good use of it. Okay, so let's get that out of the way. And we are almost at the end of this challenge. I'm not sure if I should just finish it um, and cash it in or keep going. Um, I think I'll keep going because I want to do it with silver. So I'm just going to stick to that. I'm not going to use the gold. So we can put that back. The next one I want to start is the Infinity Challenge. And this one was gifted to me by a YouTuber um, last year. She actually stopped making videos, which is unfortunate. Um, but um, she sent this to me as a gift and I'm so grateful for that. And um, it comes with this dice. And this is actually made by Budget with Ira, who's based in the UK. So... I think I'll do it how she used to do it was um, with a post-it note and then right where she landed landed um, and where do we start we start here in the middle and I have $25 from my grocery budget and we'll see how much will go in there so if we're starting in the middle and we roll it tells me to go back one so going back one means $20 will go in there and then I will write down green 20. So that's where we've landed this week and we will um, add the money. So we'll add this in first and then we'll add the money and put this back. And what I've decided to do is every week take out 25 from my grocery budget for this, this challenge. And the other five, what I'm going to do is go into my, um, uh, no, not this one, this binder here. And I am going to add it to getting ahead um, because I need to figure out how I'm going to get ahead on bills. Uh, because I was approved a mortgage it's half of what the house um, it's half of the mortgage amount but it's still a significant amount for me to be paying on my own um, someone did comment and say like a few people actually were concerned that I was taking on a mortgage but it actually works out much cheaper for me to have half of the mortgage instead of renting. So renting now where we live is upwards of $650. And I've been looking around even moving out of the area and going to, you know, less expensive areas is still 550 plus for a three bedroom house. And I would need a three bedroom because I have five kids. So I'm currently sharing with the baby and, um, I have two kids in each of the other rooms, so total five kids and myself. Um, so just to have a basic um, living, everyone has a bed to sleep in, we'd need three bedrooms. And it's moving is an expense. 
um, having a you know a bond payment or a security de deposit I would need to show um, so much things um, and m moving in itself is just a whole nother thing so it worked out for me that I have to pay $485 each week um, to cover a monthly mortgage and five week months are the same so I would still it would be four weeks worth of $485 so that's a lot cheaper for me and a lot more manageable um, and I did get approved government benefits so now combined with the family tax benefit and the parent payment benefit I'm getting $2,090 so close to $2,100 every two weeks so um, I'm still working out the budget like to be set in, in how I want to do my budget but I think I can manage um, I'm just working out work hours and things like that so yeah going ahead I'll be adding to getting ahead where I can okay so let's go back to this binder so we've done those two now I've got all these coins I've got two four six eight ten twelve fourteen sixteen eighteen uh, 17 18 and this is not one dollar this looks like a from a different country oh it says euro 50 euro cent i don't know where this is from someone must have given it to me by mistake so i have 18 to play with and we will get out our placeholders here or oh, actually i'm not going to do it with placeholders i'm just going to roll start with the two dollar coins and then um and then we'll deal with the one dollar coins i guess i'll just do it that way okay so it has been tough on my own you can probably hear my baby in the background calling out daddy daddy because he's always standing at the window waiting for daddy to come um that i think that's been tough i know it's not making him upset but it's almost like he understands um the other thing that has been tough is managing um everything on my own around the house so my ex-partner used to help with different things like packing up and bath time, bedtime, dinner time. Um, and now I don't have that. I have to do that on my own. And I'm trying to keep the kids in a pretty decent routine with meals um, and eating healthy, not just chicken nuggets and things like that. So I still am cooking every day. Um, but yeah, it is what it is. And I know time will make things um, easier and simpler and we'll, we'll get into the hang of it. So, yeah, I said, so let's get into rolling now. All right, we've got our coins here. Three. Three. One. Oh, three is getting some love today. Three. Two. Maybe if I. Oh, six. Two, two, last two coins. Ah, oh, two and five. So the one that missed out this week was four. That's okay. It's all about saving. Um, it doesn't matter where we're putting it. In the end, it's all for the same reason to to save money. So we'll go into our savings binder here, our savings challenge book, and we will color off what we've saved. So for number one, we've got $2, and I changed these to one, if you haven't been following along in this. So now that has a good chunk. Okay, number two, got $7 this week. 
So we'll add the seven in there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I have been watching a few channels and um, you can see my setup here is very simple and boring. But there is Mindy's budgeting. Um, she's in the US, but she does freebie Fridays. Um, there's six in there. In number three. Um, so she recommends ch um, channels or people that have free small challenges and she does them. And I'm thinking to, to download a few. Um, and yeah, maybe do that after I've done these ones. Number four didn't get anything. Number five got one dollar. Um, so number five isn't doing too well. Number five got one dollar, but we can swap it out for a five dollar note that we have in the back of our binder here. And we can add this dollar instead. And then um, number six got two dollars and we can do the same here. So we can put this two in the back and grab a five. Okay, one two and since it's just coins left that means that we would be able to swap these out for the um the paper one so this one doesn't have any paper money neither does this one this one doesn't this one does so what can we do here? One, two, three, and that is three dollars there. Okay. So we'll try to keep doing it that way. Um, and then once we can't make change, we'll use the placeholders. <laughs> yep, so I'm happy with that progress today. Um we added to our infinity challenge we added to our um silver coins challenge we added to um the infinity challenge of oh, the i already said that the um getting ahead and also now these one dollar challenges and look at number two it's it's almost finished and we'll be able to reallocate that money which is amazing so yeah um, I'm looking forward to seeing you next time thank you so much for watching if you're not already subscribed hit that subscribe button below and follow along in my journey thank you again and have a good week bye everyone bye for now